Hello everyone, peace of Christ to all. Today we will continue with our alphabet and this is the letter TA. If you remember, we talked before letter A, BA, and now TA. Now TA is a letter which can be connected from two sides. You can review my previous videos to refresh your memory. TA, this is how it looks like, this is how it is by itself independent not connected this is how it is as a first letter this is how it is as a second letter and second letter mean something is going to be after between all right so like there's a there's a letter in the right and letter in the left and this is how it's going to be between and this is how it's going to be where it is at the end now we will show you example how to write the letter ta remember we said before that ta as if there is a after ta ta but in fact there is no letter a you see we pronounce it but it's not there all right this is when we pronounce the letter alone remember later we will see there's vowels we add to the arabic and that will change the sound and how you say it so now let us see how we can write the letter Ta. It's very simple. We can say we have a very simple rule for all the letters which is different from the letters we showed you, those who cannot be connected from the left. You remember? There's a few letters cannot be connected from the left. To refresh your memory, we have a, da, those are in red, the, ra, za, and wa. Those letters cannot be connected from the left side, which means they can be connected only from the right. But if they are the first letter anyway, it means they cannot be connected to anything if they are the first letter. Those, those R letters are special. The rest, as we see, or as we will see later, we can connect them from right or left, it doesn't matter. Same as letter Ba can be connected from both sides. And letter Ta is the same can be connected from the right or the left it doesn't matter now we said before <coughs> that always letters when we when they are at the end they go back to the original shape if you remember all right so we said uh, what happened with my okay all right uh, this is the letter ta when it is by itself two dots very simple it's like you are drawing a dish white dish flat a little bit flat, flat all right so if it is in the beginning we make this edge and we put two dots if it is in the middle we make the line edge two dot if it's at the end it's going to be connected for a letter before it you remember we the, the the video before this one we wrote the word bait bait have the letter ta at the end so it's going to be like this bait this is a letter ba the first one the dot for it and then the two letter two dots for the letter ya and then two letters for the ta bait bait which mean home or house all right so Ta in the beginning, as you see it here, by itself. Ta as a first letter, ta as between, and ta at the end. So this little thing here before the ta we see here, this is just to connect. It doesn't matter really what is the letter before it. It doesn't matter, all right? So at the end, all letters usually, they go to original. Take that in your, in your mind. So you will not be confused how I'm going to write the letter at the end. All letters will go back to the original, which is, as we see here, this is the original. So when the letter it is at the end, is going to go back to the original with one different. If it is a letter from those who accept connection, is going to have something here to connect. All right. So in the case of ba, letter ba, if you remember, we said ba, then ba then ba so if ba at the end 
not in the beginning as in the case of a bait so let us see uh, let us see habib habib ha b ya b habib which mean lover okay so habib have two ba one as a second letter as we see here this is a second letter let me change the color so uh, you okay I will highlight it this is this is Habib and this is the dot belong to Habib and this is the dot here the first the first ba, and this is the second ba. you see it very simple very easy so all what need to remember is how to pronounce it and how to write it the reason I'm giving you how to pronounce the letter and how to write it that will make our education a lot faster a lot easier because now we are not separating the information like you know brain work like a computer if you store the information in one cell both they come together so this is how it's written and this is how it's pronounced ta ta like uh, uh, in English we say uh, uh, let us say uh, there's some some names some companies some like this they, they start with that it's, it's normal like nothing really special uh, ten, uh, tender uh, uh, in, in English you say tomorrow ta but because there's o you say tomorrow ta it's the same same as that are ta there's no different really ta in English so it's very simple very easy and writing uh, 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 this way if we learn the method is going to be a lot easier for us because it doesn't matter really where the location we gave you the letters which are cannot be connected from the left so those we be aware of them the rest are very easy you know now later we will show you that there is letters who have two dots at the at the top and one dot in the top or underneath so right now we have the ta it is the kind have two dots you see there's two dots let us go back to the writing so we have two dots this is the ta again and there's one dot one dot now later when you became advanced in writing when we write in Arabic nobody really put dots the way you see it so let us say I want to say uh, a cult I make this you see the sign which is two dot connected but for now keep it this way so you don't be confused all right uh, you know this is how we write in Arabic and everybody understand it very well uh, the, this little the thing here it's mean two dots all right so uh, but for now because you are in the stage of learning and you don't want to make mistakes just keep it two dots as it is so let us say uh, I will write another word um, uh, shaript shaript this is sha sha is a letter have it's the three edges with the three dots sha ra bit this is letter ba and this is the letter ta so here in this word we have two letters we learned already which is the ba this one and the ta this one all right shaript now you see how the ba come at the beginning all right the ba is coming in the beginning in this case as we see here this is the ba and this is the ta is coming at the end very simple very easy so if you have a question please feel free to post underneath of the video and don't hesitate to ask me questions don't worry you are not putting pressure on me I'm here to help you uh, uh, and you will see how fast and how easy you will learn just follow with me easy you know and don't don't really think it's really hard always teachers make things harder because they don't know maybe how to deliver so I think the way we are doing it is very simple very easy uh, soon we will finish all the alphabet and you will see how easy then is going to be uh, to start making words and sentence and speak in Arabic with this I say thank you don't forget to subscribe and share with your friends 
so they can join us in our channel. God bless. Thank you.